So what we know for a very long time is that potassium bromide is a source. So we, we for a very, very long time, we, we have learned that we have to ask owners to keep the salt content uh, constant. The body confuses actually uh, a bromide with chloride, as does any biochemistry analyzer does, right? When you take a blood sample of a dog on, on bromide, uh, potassium bromide, then you will see a pseudo hyperchloremia because your biochemistry analyzer will actually pick up those bromides as they would do uh, chlorides. Also, the way uh, um, this drug might be working that um, instead of having one chloride entering a neuron, you get two or three bromide ion um, entering a neuron, making it less likely to fire and so on. So the, the body already knows that bromide, potassium bromide is a salt as is a sodium chloride. So, so we know that you need to keep your salt content constant. And, and, and the, first, <laughs> the first time I realized this, you know, um, and my wife, she's a dermatologist, she always told me, yeah, you people, you know, they, they, give, they give funny, funny stuff uh, when they do nutrition. Um, when I was asking, uh, started to do a nutritional trials because we had to take a full nutritional history. And, and, and then you ask people in, in the UK, you know, they, they take certain brands and they, they have an off the shelf uh, because at that time I was still at the Royal Vet College and, and they were, they're feeding the diet, but then they gave a lot of stuff on top. And if you remember phenobarbital or potassium bromide, what it does, it, it changes your threshold in, in a way that you will be polyphagic, right? And when we care for people, we we normally provide them with food. So right when you, you go home to your mom or your dad, then then or your family or friends, they will serve you food because they they care for you, right? So we we know we our our appreciation to anyone will be shared by giving them food, right? And the same happens for pets. And if your pet is even diseased, then you want to care for that pet even more, and you want to show your love by giving it. So I, I didn't appreciate how many people are giving, sorry to that, crap from the table. And in the UK, a lot of salty food is, you know, they have um, Pizza Hut, uh, uh, chips, and so on. There's a lot of salt content, so you will have a big variation in salt. And that's something I definitely changed in, in my practice, not only asking after the, the, the normal diet where they tell you what, what they think, you know, you want to hear, but also about um, the additional stuff they get. Um, one of the things um, where we also know the potassium bromide is if you, for example, live closer to a coast side, you will have different levels of bromide because you will have uh, um, more salty uh, um, air, water, and so on. And then this is an index exchange. So I had, for example, cases where they went on holiday and suddenly they had a, a, a lack of seizure control. And, 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 and the, the reason was because not as much bromide came into um, the dog's um, diet because of the, of the seawater. Yeah. 